Audi viewers, Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, doing another Red Dead Redemption 2 challenge video. Challenges are a huge part of 100%. You have to have them all done, otherwise you won't get 100%. The good part is you don't have to do them all as Arthur, though you would like to because you get a special outfit at the end of doing all the challenges. But I digress. This is weapons expert number nine, where you have to kill nine unaware enemies with a bow. In other words, you gotta shoot them in the back with an arrow. And you wanna have improved arrows when you do this, or shoot them in the head with a regular arrow. What I chose to do is essentially stalk around Hangdog Ranch, where I know the old Driscolls are hanging out and shoot any unsuspecting O'Driscoll. But you kill a few of them, you alert the rest of them, and you gotta run away. And once you run away, all you gotta do is go camping or something and come back. I'll show you how I did it. This is weapons expert number nine. Now have Arthur sneak up on Hangdog Ranch in the morning. If you look at the heads-up display, if the red dot is facing away from Arthur and that white kind of fuzziness is away from Arthur, yeah, you can shoot the guy and now you have one of nine and it starts. Good part is you don't have to be consecutive. You can snipe them, run away, and... Come back later. I shot the other guy, so now I should have two. And usually you can get about two, maybe three guys shot before the rest of the old Driscolls are alerted. Yep, two of nine kill. And I did the stupid thing first. And once I tried to jump over this fence and get that guy standing at the gate, that alerted the old Driscolls. Crap, someone noticed Arthur. Time to run, 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 get out of here. Like I said, you can run away and come back later and take down some more guys, but you don't want to get shot. The tricky part of this challenge is getting the guy in the back and not wasting a shot. Now, technically, I kill this guy. He is unaware. He hasn't paid attention to me, but when I shoot him, He's dead, the O'Driscolls are alerted, and I gotta run away. And to be honest with you, I don't think it counted. I had three kills already. Now, this should be the fourth if it counts. I'm flipping around here. Yeah, I better get the hell out of here and let's see. Progress. I gotta go to the challenge. Gotta flip through the, uh, yeah, weapons expert. Yeah, that guy didn't count, so I wasted a shot. I only have three kills, so I got to run away and come back later. After you take some shots and kill some guys, what you can do, ride off, hunt, 
fish, camp, and craft, you know, just spend some time away, and even you can see the hangdog rat in the background, you want to get the um, bad guys to reset and put new um, guards, lookouts around so that you can come in behind them and shoot them. It doesn't take too long. You don't have to sleep an entire day and come back. All you got to do is run away for, I don't know, about a few hours game time at most. Six hours game time, no big deal. You come back, you can sneak up and still snipe guys. After camping, I decided to come back and I'm going to try and get this guy in the tower. I want to check things out. I want to make sure his back is to me. Yep. And then there's some other guys around. Nope. I can snipe this guy in the tower and be able to get another kill. Yeah, the bow works better than the rope. So let's see what happens. Well, that alerted the O'Driscolls, even though it counted. Arthur has to run away. You want to try and maximize your kill when you're doing this. Two or three guys is about the most, then you just run away. The easiest way to get two kills is to sneak up on what would be the north side of Hangdog Ranch and try and take out the guy who's by what I would say is the outhouse and then the guy with his back by the gate you can take those two out quickly maybe you can get this guy but you don't want to alert the guy who's facing you so let's see yeah i can't get him from cover and once i move he's still in cover so yeah just go for the guy who's by the outhouse or the back house whatever it is and the gate guy and run away Get the guy by the gate. You can do it outside the fence line and standing up, but then that alerts the rest of the O'Driscolls. If you come here early in the morning, you might be able to get three guys before you have to run, but usually you should get two then you got to run, otherwise you're going to end up shot. Took the easiest guy down first. I had six, so I should have seven now. Let's take a look. Yeah, okay. Yep, seven. Now I just need two more. I'm going to take the guy down by the gate, down, and kill him, and I should then have eight.
Oh crap, missed them. I better run and get the hell out of here. This sucks. After a little camping and crafting, I come back to Hangdog Ranch here. I should take down the two easy kills. I have seven, and this challenge will be complete. Challenge complete, 9 of 9 bow stealth kills, time to hightail it out of here and on to kill a grizzly bear without taking damage using only throwing knives. Can anything get easier? And I will do a video on it. I'm Brad, proprietor of our Stool Entertainment. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. Feel free to leave some comments. If you like this type of video, Hit the subscribe button and bell icon. I post four video game related videos a week and some specials and shorts and you don't want to miss out. As always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and thanks for stopping by.